hi guys welcome back to mrs dre food channel in today's video i'm going to show you how to fry the best tilapia crispy on the outside and soft on the inside so if you are interested let's get right into it so i have got here large tilapias that have already been gutted first step is to wash it so right now i'm going to place it in the sink and add some cold water to it usually i wash it with some fresh lemons or limes but i didn't have it this time so i'm using lemon juice which also does the job add enough of it and start washing the fish Once I have done that, I'll keep washing the fish under the cold water, under running cold water and remove any unwanted things in the fish. So roughly it takes me a good 15 to 20 minutes to make sure I have properly washed the fish. Although they do wash it at the fishmongers, but I don't trust them they just do it anyhow so best to wash it yourself at home by taking your time right the fish is ready and now I'm going to pat dry it with some kitchen towel and then I'm gonna add my seasoning so I'm going to use all-purpose seasoning next I'm going to add some garlic granules. We really love garlic in this house. I think you must have noticed it already. You can also use garlic powder if that's what you have. Next, I'm going to add some smoked paprika. If you've never used smoked paprika, it goes very well with fish. Alternatively, you can use just ground paprika if you can't find this one. And then I'm going to add some hot curry powder. Again, curry powder goes perfectly well with fried fish. And last but not least, I am going to add some salt to taste. And that's it for the seasoning and not more than that. And then with clean hands, I am going to mix it all together. You can also wear gloves if you have well the fish is ready so now i am going to cover it with some cling film and then i'll leave it in the fridge for a minimum of two hours because i want it well marinated and i am not in a rush this time after two hours i'm going to pour some fresh vegetable oil and let it heat up in the meantime I'm going to get my flour ready I'm using all-purpose flour or plain flour depending on how you call it and the quantity really depends on the quantity of fish you have and the secret here to make it nice and crispy is adding corn flour to it yes it's corn flour um, I believe in the US you call it cornstarch but in the UK, it's corn flour. And then I'm going to mix it very well. So the flour is ready. So now let's take our fish back from the fridge. There it is, nice and well marinated. And now you know what comes next. We are going to coat the fish with the flour and corn flour mixture. And don't forget to remove the excess flour and I'm telling you the fish will come out nice and crispy and so moist inside and also the flour prevents it from falling apart so this is also one of the reason we use flour so I'm going to carry on coating my fish and I'll see you when it is time to fry it. So 
For now, enjoy the music. Dear friends, I have finished coating the tilapia and to have even more flavor, I'm going to add a little onion in my oil and let it fry for a few minutes. I am also going to add some dried rosemary. I usually use a fresh one, but this time again, I didn't have it. Well, that's okay. It's still rosemary. And then I am going to fry the tilapia. Make sure you do not overcrowd it so that the oil doesn't get cold and wait for the magic let it fry for some minutes depending on how you like it and don't forget to turn it over so that it fries evenly And guys, it smells so good in my kitchen. I can't wait to taste a bit fried tilapia. All right, it is nice and ready. I'm just going to show you a close up right now. Just look at this beauty. This is the perfect fried crispy tilapia. You are going to love it so this is how i like it so i'm going to remove it from the oil but if you like it a bit more darker please leave it to fry for a few more minutes but this is how i like mine and it's perfect like this so i'll now go ahead and fry the remaining fish that is left and that's it Hey friends, this is the end result. Look at this perfect golden fried tilapia for your kenke, your banku, even for your stews, for whatever you want to eat it with. This is going to be your favorite fried fish. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you next time for another Mrs. Jury recipe. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and don't forget to like, to share my videos and See you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.